Good morning, I'm Chris Dickens, the blue guy on the blue bike that rides late at night with lots of lots of lights. Be seen, be safe, a $10 device can save your life. I'm promoting bike safety in this lecture. And that goes for one of my parts of my equipment. Okay, let's find that thing first. There it is. I have a new suit on and I have also have new lights. And no, I'm not going to use a white suit. If you notice, I got a, a first plate on now with cool armbands. Let's take a look. I'm going to put some lights and wires in here to make it brighten up. I got a light in my hand for this suit. Let's see if we can put it on. Oh, there's, there's another part. Let's take a look at the shark. This baby cost me some money. All right, it has a couple modes in here. And ba -ba -ba, alien mode. That's gonna go in the suit right here. And guess what? Bam. It also has lasers. Let's turn off this top light. There we go, we'll see if you, I don't know if y'all can see that, but this baby has lasers. <laughs> Alright, enough for that fix. So I'm making a new suit and I got two new lights to go on my bike there on. And the reason why I'm wearing a white suit because sometimes I'm at, I'm at my house and I'm working, I'm working on my bike, and I just wanted to hurry up and take a quick rod to test out the new lights or whatever I have gotten. You stay right there. Watch me. Don't 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 run away. Don't run away. It's could be simple. This this there you go. Also blinking mode. It blinks. Come on the shark it goes behind your bike. Kinda of looks like that. I can range where it looks different. Hope y'all can see that. And let's get it closer so you can see that. There you go. Shines lasers and the other mode is this. I like that. That's gonna look good in the suit. What you think? Looking at me backwards. What you think? Alright, put that there. Shines the light on me. Alright. I'm gonna put this in my suit real quick. I'm gonna place that baby right there. That's what my new suit might look like. I'm gonna let y'all be the judges of that. Shall I get this new suit a runabout? And also, I'm gonna start doing rollerblading. I'm going go manual like front and rollerblade manual like front with safety gear on. I'm also looking for donations of old helmets. If you got an old helmet that you don't use no more, I'm going to put the address down link below and you can mail it to me. If you're a big corporation and you want to promote bike safety, you can mail me, uh, mail me old helmets that y'all cannot use no more or donate to me for bike safety. I would appreciate that. Um, let's take a look at that suit. Looks like my heart's beating. Watch out, oh, Iron Man. <laughs> Whoops. <laughs> I can put this light there. I don't know what I'm gonna do with this suit. I got all kinds of good options I can do with it. I can put all kinds of string lights or Christmas lights. They, they're cheap as hell. Yeah, let's turn on this one. So you can see me in red. Which one y'all like better? White or red? Y'all never leave any... Well, people have been leaving responses. Thank you for the sponsors. Thank you for uh, for the, those who donated over the past few years. I appreciate that. I also looking for donations of hard hats. I want to go out and use and show people the difference of wearing them and not wearing them. If y'all have any, I just need two hard hats, you know, the helmet, the, 
that bikers wear to donate uh, bike safety. Feels like I'm stepping on a dead body. <laughs> That'd be messed up. And promote bike safety and dyslexia. All right, let's take a look at that new light on my bike. I got two of them. And it's so awesome that I'm going to get more. Here you go, watch this baby. Da, da, da. Da, da, da. I got two of them. Da. What you think of that? Alien technology or what? Turn off all these lights so you can see. Because wearing my costume, well, all the lights does blur out other lights that I have on. That's why I try not to use certain type of lights. Look at that. Now I got two sides. I need to fix it where it shines about right here. Because it, it, sh it shows, but I could also turn it around, have it shine in the, in the woods. I don't know if y'all can see that. Let's try the other side. I think this one of them was brighter than the other. There you go. I don't know if y'all can see that, but there's lights all through the woods. Now that might be blinding because if you was a car, would you like to have that in your face? You'd be swerving around. So I think it's a safety issue. So we'll have to face them down. I'm trying to do everything with safety. That's why I wear this type of mask at night because I can see better instead of the full uniform of the uh, morph suit. That's, that's why I got the mask for. I just want to turn on these two brand new lights. These are going to be an addition to my bike. I hope you enjoy. Uh, for those who want to donate, you can send to a P.O. Box 1712 Lacombe Highway 190. Zip code 704 Four four five. Uh, I think that's it. That's all you need on Highway 190, Lacombe, P.O. Box 1712, zip code 70444, and L.A., which is Louisiana. I think I got all the, the information that you need. Louisiana, P.O. Box 1712, zip code 70445, uh, Highway 190. You can have it shipped there if you're a multiple, multiple corporation and like to promote bike safety. If you have anything that related to bikes or you like to donate bikes or you have a light that you want to explore with me, because I have worked with lights. I've been working with a lot of lights and I'll definitely tell you it's recommended or not recommended. Some of the lights I have taken off because I do not recommend them no more because they're junk. Junk. Those little lights that takes those little bitty flat batteries. Oh yeah, you can't see me, huh? Oh, we're working in the dark. Wait, you say turn on the light. Man, fall. Freak. Freak the freaking freakers. Why you didn't say something? The light was off all this time and you didn't say nothing. Come on, you could have said something. All right. Now, if you're a multiple corporation and you would like to donate, for bike safety or dyslexia or any type of cause you can send it to that address below I'm going to leave a, a link below also holy crap the lights went up aliens so I'm looking for two helmets and I'm going to go in Manville and I'm going to show everybody I'm going to bring two cantaloupes and uh, smash them well, there's going to be more than two, because you need more than two for this de demonstrations. And I just want to show, you can be child helmet or adult helmets. As long as it's some type of helmet that is used for bike safety. Uh, one second. <coughs> Look at the world. Oh, yeah, that was my zipper. Uh, oh, my bag, of course. I hope you like my new uh, uniform. It's just a... I'm not going to wear white. This is the only reason why I'm wearing white is just to hurry up and do a bike test or rob my bike for a few minutes and it's late at night anyway. So no one's going to see me anyway. But I'm still going to wear my mask because I am a superhero. And superheroes do wear masks. Batman wear a mask. 
Robin wear the mask? Spawn wear the mask? Superman never wear a mask because he's already camouflaged when he turns to a human. So he doesn't wear a mask. Makes you wonder about that, huh? Almost every villain and every superhero always has a mask. Let's see. Name a hero that has no mask. Plainly shows, hey, I'm this guy. I'm this hero. You were going to do a bot. Show me. Except for villains. Most villains do not wear masks. Like Punisher. Punisher is probably the only one I know of that doesn't not wear a mask. He lets you know, I'm not. Um, yeah, he does change his name. Most, almost almost every character in cartoons changed their name. I'm not talking about Dragon Ball Z either. I'm talking about normal DC and AC, whatever DC comics. Them superheroes. And not the heroes you see on TV with the all kinds of powers. I'm talking about the DC comic heroes. They usually wear a mask or they don't wear a mask. Or change their name to something else. Like Punisher. Punisher doesn't would not wear a mask. I don't know anybody else who doesn't wear a mask who's evil besides natural makeup like the Joker. <laughs> he fell into a chemical plant or something and changed his appearance. That's not his fault. But he did change his name to Joker. So knowing that uh, let's see. Got a couple more minutes because I want to go do one take on this. Got 17 minutes and 37 seconds to do one video clip with this camera. That's why I don't like this camera. Plus, it takes forever to download. But you did need a new video, and I need to show you that I'm still alive and I still got lights. Look at those lights. Let's take a look as far away. Tell me what you think. Let me know down below in the comment section about the new light system. I've been looking for something that does this. And I'm like, wait a minute, what is this? And it says, I got this from Walgreens. Most of my purchases is Walgreens, Walmart, Academy, Sears, and once in a while Home Depot. Depends on what they got. And auto parts stores. Almost every auto parts store has some type of light, car light, or some type of thing I could use for a bike. I just put a battery on it and it works. Imagine that sucker being out there. Look at that. Or should I leave it in close? I'll let y'all decide. What you think? Should I bring it out some more or leave it in? Like they always say, it's your bike, but I love different, I love opinions. And no one gives them. They always ask my questions, but they don't give me opinions. Oh, you should do this, you should do that. You should do this and you should not do that. A lot of things I do not do, because I have my rules. I explained that in my rules in one of my videos, somewhere below, somewhere or on the side, or whatever your computer does, it's up or below or somewhere around on your computer or your little phone or your little Android, whatever you use. So tell me what you think. Keep the suit, not the white one, just the armor plate. Put some lights through it, make it look cool. I'm gonna keep these so you can't say nothing about that. That sucker just bleeding away. It's living energy. Oh, it's like an alien aircraft in there. Look at it square. Oh shit, got a customer coming. Yeah, this is bright someone. Should I blind him back? You're lucky I'm not riding my bike, because I'll blind his ass. I got my high beams too. Well, I'm gonna let him ride. Ah, there you go. Look at the suit from a distance. Now you can see it with more light. What you think? I'm pull a little light here, some wires through it, make it look pretty. This might be about FBI, CIA. I don't know. 
slowly approaching me. Is he gonna stop? I like a deer in headlights. You should have seen my face when he passed by. I was frozen in fear. Oh my god, it's doing flip. Nope, it's an alien. I probably saw what the hell. But hey, now you saw my suit in full view. What did you think? Leave a comment below. I know you're probably laughing about the headlights. <laughs> That's kind of outrageous. Uh, I should have blinded them, but I wasn't riding. So, only time I blind people, if I'm riding my bike, and you turn on your brights. I got my brights too. And you should give, that's part of the law, you should give respect to a bike like, uh, uh it's like, ah! When somebody's riding a bike, turn on your dims, because they get blind and they can't see where to go on the road as much as you. So, knowing that, I'm Chris Dickens, the blue guy on the blue bike, that rides late at night, with a lots and lots of lights. Be seen, be safe, a $10 of ice can save your life. Now, if you don't believe me, you can look at my Facebook and you'll see some pictures of some, uh, uh, some lights that you can buy. Some of the things I, can re I recommend and some of those I do not recommend. I'm going to take a video, up, uh, I'm going to make a video of the, the, the lights I recommend and the ones I really don't recommend. But a quick fix, I'll show you those for, for the quick fix. And I'll show you those who don't have a quick fix. Like I said, I'm Chris Dickens, the blue guy on the blue, blue, blue bike that rides late at night. Ta-ta!